Hello there, everybody. My name is Peeporp, and welcome back to Vault Hunters Season 2. I use the voice because it's very epic. In the last episode, we started planning the castle, and the plans have been planning. I've already got a kind of idea of what I want to do this episode. I want to do some building, and I might start with the front area here. There are two constants in Minecraft recording, and that is when you start your recording, you either need to go straight to sleep or it's raining. I got one of them. And also between episodes, I have actually been organizing. There are things in the chests. I haven't unlocked the mod yet to do drawers, which would probably have been a better plan. However, I'm really not used to modded yet. It's still a very vanilla way of thinking. I really need to uh, get more acquainted with some of the mod packs. Speaking of mod packs, though, let's head over to the temporary base, which has now got chests with room in it. Look at this. Oh, my goodness. I have started to make a magnet. I've made one magnet and I just need to make a second magnet because in the last episode if I try and find it, I got some upgrade bases for me pouches and I am trying to make a pickup upgrade so that I don't have to like keep clicking it. I have all of this stuff. I can do all of this. I just need to make another magnet and I need five magnetite ingots to make it and see, this is why I'm organized. See, I've got three out of five. So I need to go and run a vault to go and get some magnetite. I haven't been picking it up like I should, but that's okay. I'm going to get some magnet pouches very, very soon. All right, before we do any like actual vault hunters things, that will be later on in the episode. I do want to get this build started. Uh, basically, what I'm thinking is that it won't be as thick as this. As it is, this is just kind of the template for the area kind of thing. So what I'm thinking of doing is basically, I've got a load of andesite, and I'm going to be kind of just making the shell of this, or just like the kind of shape that I'm wanting first, and then move on to the details and getting all those lovely things ready. So yeah, I'm going to do a little bit of building and I'll be right back. Okay, so this is the kind of shape that I'm going to be going with. Now, I know it looks weird, but it's a process and trust the process. Just trust it. It's going to be, just trust me. It's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. But the thing that mainly is missing is all the details and also a roof. And what I've done over here is make a tiny little cactus farm because what I want to use for the roof of this castle, I don't know if you've noticed... But I'm green. I got a bit of green on me. Uh, it's on my head. Not the crown. But you know, I've got some green on me. So I want to make the roof of the castle green. And what I want to use is... I want to use these green terracotta shingles. I think they will look so, so nice. Uh, mixed with some like moss and stuff like that. Just to get some good texture. But I really want to use shingles for the roof. It's much better than just regular terracotta. I wish we had shingles in the game, Mojang. Dear Mojang, please, can we have some green shingles? Thank you. But while I'm collecting the cacti, I think I'm going to do some Vault Hunters things, you know, like the actual mod pack is. So I want to run a couple of vaults with my level 9 vault crystals and just get some stuff. I'm also, I'm going to see if there are any... Bounties that I think I, I think I accepted and bounty. Also want to get some soul shards. Let's see what's what's there today. Uh, an echo pog. I would love a skill orb, but that is a lot of shards. That is so many. But yeah, we've got one to complete another vault because you, there is a chance of getting some rare vault gear on that one. So, also somebody in the comments mentioned to me that I could re-roll the not so great gear that we got last time. I mean, the crown is cool looking, but it's not that great, honestly. So, I had a look on the wiki, and there was something called, uh, is it an artisan scroll? Something like that? But something that I can use to re-roll my armor. But, what has happened in the new update, or, it, well, in this version, is that there is something called a, um, it's now a vault artisan station? So I'm going to make 
one of those and see if I can re-roll using that. So we've got a Vault Artisan Station. And let's get the rolls so I can put the Artisan Station over here on the forge. So what I can do is some stuff. I really need to figure out how to... So I need some coins and I need some plates. Yeah, sheets, vault, plates, sheets. They're not plates. You don't eat off them. It is vault plating, though. I feel him. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed now. They are plates. Maybe you can eat off them. So we go here. We put the plates there and that there. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. What's going on? I don't know. I'm going to have to go look at the thing again. I don't know. I'll be right back. So it turns out I need to find these scrolls in the vault. That's cool. All right, I'm gonna, I just made that for nothing. That's fine. I'll figure out what to do with it another time. <laughs> but that means it is time to uh, go run some vaults and get some magnetite as well earlier for the pouch. I think that would be a good plan. After we've done a vault or two, we can come back and finish this build. Part of the build. Section, build section. That's the one. All right, let's build. <laughs> I wish my name was Bill Section. <laughs> <laughs> cut that cut it. no all right let's go let's go do a vault <laughs> apparently it's a nice vault ornate chests and beginner's grace very nice so people have been asking me for some tips and also tricks for doing vaults because i might be a bit good at them maybe sometimes but my main tip for a vault is find look, 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 monolith first time is um is not to die is my <laughs> is my first tip and trick do not die that is very helpful hi gang hi hi yeah don't die heal often there's my there's my main top tips ah get away from me ah 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 no! Well, that's sad, actually. I got too big for my britches, and I got overwhelmed. That's fine. That's fine, we'll do another one. Let's do this again. I mean, for the first time. First time. First time doing a vault. This vault is a little bit different than one I've seen before. What is this? Hello. Lead lantern. Oh, that gives me poisoning. Cool. Like a gemstone? Dealy? This is pretty sick, actually. This is a cool design. I want to find the monoliths, though. There's three of them. Oh my goodness gracious me. It's raining. Oh! And it's a... It's a... Oh, what is this? This is cool. This is epic. I like the train room. This is the train room. Oh, there's TNT. But be careful. Is there anything in the... In here? Oh, I'm going to have to go digging, aren't I? No! Well, that went well. Shout out to the she- Shout out to the soul shard that just got killed by the cat- Oh my goodness gracious me. I'm out of here for sure. <laughs> no thanks, no more of that. I need to actually survive this time. That would be very helpful, actually. Okay, so we definitely have enough magnetite now. If I survive, I will. I always do. Never, never not survive. This place is a death trap. This place is for killing me. That's what it's made for. For trying to kill me. Ah! Get away from me. Ah! Nice block. I'm really annoyed that I died in my last. I mean, I. Yeah. I wanted that shield. Why you hit so hard? Why you run so fast? Why you run so fast and hit so hard? I do not like it here. Let me be. Let me get this loot. Yeah, I'm gonna get out of here and actually be able to keep my stuff. That would be that would be pretty nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah. I've got the speed. I've got the rush. I've got the agility. To make it out of here alive. I'm going to have to run quickly through the desert village room. That's fine. I think they're mad at me for blowing up their big wagon. Is it a wagon? I think it's a... 
minecart. Big minecart. Maybe they've forgotten. Definitely not starting to get concerned that there's two and a bit minutes left and I still haven't found the desert village room. Scared. Oh, that. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Okay, here it is. Here it is. Move. Goodbye. Okay, so this is the starting room. Do you have any time? Any chests? Oh, there's some more Nate ones up there. I'm being cheeky. I'm being cheeky and greedy. Alright, yep, I'm out. I'm calling it. I'm calling it now. I'm not going to let my greed get in the way of me actually surviving a vault. Let's finish. And... I'm very, very close to leveling up. <laughs> That's fine. I could just make a little burgie. I make a little burger guy. Let's see if we can get anything from these booster packs. Nothing fantastic as per. It's fine. Definitely a, a reason to have them in the game. Yes. But that means we have the magnetite that we need. I think if we make just one double cheeseburger, I'll be able to level up to level 11. Let's go. Yes. Yeah. It was not in vain. It was not in vain, but I need to take these raw magnetite over to get coal. Can I take a furnace with me? I've got furnace. I got fern eye. It's fine. Wait, I don't need a ferny. I don't need a fern eye. I'm stupid. I need to put it around a chromatic iron. There's there's lots of people on the server right now, so it's a little bit laggy. Let's make a uh, magnet. And now we have two magnets, which means... Okay, we got everything there. So let's put this all together. If I can remember what goes where. Did I put my steel nuggets back? Well, I, put, I didn't put the nuggets back, but I kept the thingies. My Okay. And now we can put it together. If I remember how to do it. And here we are, is the pickup upgrade. So now... If I put that here, pick up settings. Okay, so we can also block uh, things that can be picked up. So if we come up here, it's get it gets magic. Mod modding is magic. It can't even see me through the slit. In my modding is magic. Okay, so cool. So now our pouch can just pick up stuff, which is very very helpful indeed. Wow, what fun! That was great. What fun vaults vault. Well, just the one. Just the one vault. It was only only the one. Yeah, yeah, okay. But now we've done lovely, fun things, and now I can pick things up with my mind, and definitely not magnets. I think that we are going to build the front facade. Uh, I've got some materials. Whoa, look, I've got some surface moss and... And some cobblestone. Ignore those. I'm not going to use those. But look, I got the green terracotta shingles. Oh, they shingly. Oh, I'm shingly in my boots. Uh, I'm going to put them on the roof. It's going to be like my head. But technically, your hair is the roof, right? So this castle is just going to be like a big me. But like weirdly shaped. It's going to be like an abstract art piece of my head. <laughs> Let's just build. <laughs>
Oh, oh, beautiful. <laughs> I spent a lot of time having quite a lot of fun, actually, playing around with all the different modded blocks. We've got so many different ones here, and it's looking fabulous. I can't lie. I'm really excited and also quite scared to... Uh, work on the rest of this castle now that the front is done but i feel like we've made it, the first puzzle piece is in place so now the rest of it is just gonna come so easily what do you think what do you think of the uh the design how are you feeling how are you feeling about the block some cut tough and we got some tough and also some surface moss which is very very nice indeed and some moss with the supports. All of this is uh, polished andesite bricks and just polished andesite there. And we've got some pillars and also some braziers at the front. And a nice little doorway. I think I'm going to put a stained glass window here of some kind. And I love these little parapets here. These tiny little spruce parapets that just... They, it doesn't look like much, but all together, it really frames this window nicely. I really want to change the windows, though. I don't like these. But the windows that I do want are locked behind the create mod. So I'm going to have to unlock the create mod to kind of finish this castle and change the windows out. But that'll be fine. That's that's This is good enough for now. I think that this looks great. And if we walk in, there's nothing. There is nothing. I'm going to clear all this out off camera probably between episodes and then next episode we can work on the entrance and maybe some more of the wall maybe not next episode i i don't know i just it's really fun to build i'm to all you people that know me from vault hunters you might not know that i really like building like building is kind of like my thing i it's it's my thing as you might be able to tell now, I do enjoy doing and build. So we've got the green terracotta shingles up here as well, like the hair of the castle. And there's more behind this kind of arch here. You can't really see from... Yeah, you can see from the side here. It's archy. I might change those to stairs, but we'll see. We'll see. It's uh, it's all uh, not final, but this is a very, very good idea of how the whole castle is going to look. And I love it. I'm very, very happy with it. But that... I'm afraid, means that it's going to be the end of the episode here. It was next episode, we might do some more vault runs with more of the peeps. I've uh, kind of been recording all of these videos at like 3 o'clock in the morning when nobody's around. Oops! <laughs> but if you enjoyed the video, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. Put some comments down below as the sun sets. Really kind of like affirming my start of the video. It, the sun's going down. This has been another episode of Vault Hunters. My name is Peeporp, and I shall see you in the next episode. So goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. <laughs>